the case for Pastor Dennis Watson's daughter, who's located in South Tampa with her family right now weathering the storm. And it's a terrifying time because they're not accustomed to dealing with hurricanes like we are here in southeast Louisiana. Thousands of Floridians prepared to evacuate their homes as the state prepared for Hurricane Ian to make landfall as a Category 4 hurricane. But many weren't so fortunate. They're experiencing a lot of uh, wind gusts, a lot of heavy rain. Uh, and so it's been, it's been a challenging time for them. Dennis Watson is the lead pastor at Celebration Church right here in New Orleans, and he has many loved ones in Florida. His nephew is in Cape Coral, his brother lives in Central Florida, and his daughter and her family are hunkered down in South Tampa, riding out the strong winds and rain. To evacuate, if you're in South Florida, you're already behind the people evacuating in the central part of the state, northern part of the state, and it's just almost impossible. The interstates are clogged up. There's no fuel to be purchased. Pastor Watson says his family is safe, and so far they have no damage, but they're experiencing lots of anxiety and nervousness. He prayed for them last night and is asking the community to keep them and others in prayer. Every text, every message, every phone call uh, brings, a, brings a measure of uh, hope and encouragement to them and lets them know that people uh, all over the nation are praying for them and praying for, the, for, for God to protect them and provide for them in every way. Now, Celebration Church is already mobilizing donations and volunteers to send to Florida as soon as next week. Now, Pastor Dennis encourages people to donate to noteworthy organizations that will be helping Florida recover. Reporting live in studio, Courtney Williams, WDSU News. All right, Courtney, thank you so much.